Hey everybody, it's just Chrissy again, and today I'm going to show you how I moisturize and seal my hair. So this is how I wore my hair today. It's kind of curled or whatever, as you can see. So you just want to lightly brush it, and you can see it still has the curl. You could leave that. Don't even worry about it. I usually moisturize and seal in four parts, but I'm going to just leave my hair how it is right now and just go from what I already have. So I've already done the left side. I just split it up into two sections. Apply my my ion leave-in conditioner, and then I went on top of that with my little oil concoction. I just put three or four drops in my hand and massage it through from the ends. It's not a bad idea if you want to go over your ends again, because I do that sometimes just to make sure that you didn't miss anything. So since I already did that side, I'm just going to show you how I do it using the right side so I'm gonna just split it like that with my hand take my brush and just gently brush it a little bit and you can see this brush kind of has little teeth in it and the balls at the end so just go ahead and brush it like that then I'm gonna take my ion leave-in and I'm gonna do it four times in my hand and then I'm just gonna work that through like that make sure I'm getting my ends I'm getting the top of my hair and I'm getting underneath and then take your little oil mixture like I said three or four drops is fine it depends on the thickness of your oil if your oil is really thick I would use one or two drops if it's kind of loose I would use probably about three or four depending on your hair <coughs> sorry my hair does soak up oil so I just use three or four during the night just to make sure that it stays moisturized throughout the day as well. So that's that side. And then we're going to do the last piece. Same thing. Take your brush. Gently brush it. And I did roll my hair really, really tight because I don't want to sleep in rollers every night because it's uncomfortable. <laughs> That's just point blank period. It's uncomfortable. So I rolled it really tight that way. I'll just wrap it for the next couple of days. And then in two days, I'll roll it again. And that's kind of how I try to do it to avoid keep putting heat on my hair and hot curling it every morning. Roll it really tight one day. And then you can wear those curls for a couple of days or just wear it straight however you want to do it. So that side is all brushed out. Take my moisturizer again. Four times in my hand. Grab that piece, make sure I'm applying it all over, especially, especially your ends, like so. Take my oil mixture, put it in my hand, rub it together, and apply it. Okay, now since I've done my whole head already, what I'll do before I wrap my hair like I said, I do my oil as near or every other day. And I didn't put oil in my scalp yesterday. And as you can see, my relaxer took really, really good. I'm actually very happy with the results. And since I've been all in my scalp and really taking my time to take care of my hair, I had no chemical burn whatsoever. My scalp does not feel tight. It didn't feel itchy. It didn't feel any of that. So I'm so happy with the results of the relaxer and how my scalp feels. I have, usually when I do a perm, I get chemical burn, at least in one spot, I have no chemical burn because I was not scratching my scalp. I wash my hair once a week. I even washed my hair the week before I permed it. And just, just that washing didn't do anything to give me chemical burn because I've been making sure to take care of my scalp. Moisturizing and sealing every night, all in my scalp, every other day, washing and deconditioning or washing and using protein or co-washing and deconditioning once a week so last thing i'm going to do is i'm going to take this oil with a little slanted tip and i'm just going to point it where i want the oil to go in my scalp like this and then after this i'm going to wrap it i'm not going to show y'all how to wrap hair because it really doesn't matter i mean People know how to wrap hair. If, you, if you're black, you should know how to wrap hair. But anyway, so wrap your hair how you want it. If you don't want to wrap it, you can just leave it like this, put it in a ponytail, whatever you want to do. And that is it for my nighttime routine. Moisturizing and sealing. And I will see y'all next time. It's just Christy.